The man, the legend, the myth, and billionaire Elon Musk is one of the world's most fascinating CEOs in the world. This South African tech entrepreneur is the market leader in electric vehicles and renewable energy, and he's also the founder of SpaceX, a firm that promises to make spaceflight a reality for the common person. But what the average person out there wants to know is what expensive things Elon Musk owns. In this video, we will be revealing the luxurious items in the billionaire's possession. But before we get into today's exciting video, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of the new videos we post. Now, let's get to it. At number 10, a Tesla Ring. In 2018, jewelry designer Ben Baller sent Elon Musk a one-of-a-kind Tesla ring, composed of high-quality diamonds and rubies for Christmas, merely for having big balls. Ben Baller crafted the $37,000 ring with a Tesla logo, specially for Elon Musk. He gave Elon the ring as a gift. On why he gave out the ring, Baller tweeted, Why are we giving you this ring? Because you have motivated me and Paul to level up and push limits. We salute you for giving almost 50,000 jobs to Americans and putting the USA back on the map as a serious contender in the auto industry. At number 9, the Musk Roadster. SpaceX launched Falcon Heavy, the world's most powerful operational rocket from Florida in 2018, carrying Elon Musk's personal Tesla Roadster into orbit. The sports automobile is piloted by Starman, a mannequin dressed in a spacesuit. The spacecraft is still orbiting the sun, following a lonely, oblong orbit that takes it as near to Mars and as far from Earth orbit at times. The Roadster isn't on some kind of scientific adventure. SpaceX just wanted a dummy payload for the test launch, and Musk, who previously stated that he intended it to be the silliest thing imagined, chose his own high-end Tesla car. The Tesla Roadster, which cost over $200,000, boasts a top speed of almost 250 miles per hour and a 0-60 to 60 time of 1.9 seconds. The automobile had a 630-mile range, seats four people, is totally electric, and has a retractable roof. For an open-air, convertible driving experience, the glass roof folds into the trunk. At number 8, the James Bond car. It's no secret that Elon Musk is a colorful character and a very wealthy one at that. You can imagine the shenanigans he'd get if he got his hands on some James Bond gear. After all, he started making flamethrowers as a joke and sold all 20,000 of them in less than a day. Elon purchased the 1976 Lotus Esprit featured in the movie The Spy Who Loved Me in 2013. You should know that the car is a true Bond classic. While underwater, the sports automobile transforms into a submarine and shoots missiles. It's one of the instantly recognizable 007 vehicles in the ever-growing collection. The car in issue was one of the eight that were used in the film's production, but it was the only one that was ever used in underwater scenes. After filming, the car sat in a storage container for the next 12 years, accumulating dust until an astonishing three-figure purchase. A maritime engineering business transformed the Lotus into a functioning submarine for the film at a cost of more than $100,000, which is the equivalent of roughly $425,000 US in today's money. In 2013, a then-secret bidder paid $1 million for the Lotus at RM Sotheby's auction. There was no mistake this time around, at a price of 9,970 times more than it was in 1989. Elon Musk had reportedly had his eye on this Lotus since he was a child. Since then, the billionaire has stated that the car was a source of inspiration for Tesla's Cybertruck design. Elon even hinted that the Cybertruck may take more inspiration from the Lotus than one, tweeting that the vehicle will even float for a while in response to a concern that how will it manage shallow water. At number 7, X.com Long before the first Tesla Model X rolled off the manufacturing line and SpaceX launched its first rocket into orbit, Elon Musk was a successful online entrepreneur. He has now regained a piece of internet history by purchasing the dead domain name x.com from his old employer, PayPal. To grasp the significance of the URL, go back to 2000, when Musk's online financial services business, x.com, joined with Confinity, which was then running a little-known money transfer service named PayPal. Investors and board members agreed that x.com had a better brand recognition than Confinity when the two firms merged. However, in 2001, 
A year after Musk departed the company due to differences with the other executives, the entire company was relaunched as PayPal. But after PayPal went public, eBay bought it for $1.5 billion in 2002, netting Musk anywhere between $160 and $180 million after taxes. Fast forward a decade and a half, Musk is now one of the world's most successful entrepreneurs, with three multi-billion dollar businesses in the electric car, solar energy, and space transportation industries. Musk, who has a net worth of $15.3 billion thanks to his stakes in Tesla, SpaceX, and SolarCity, can buy anything he wants, including dead domain names. Single-digit domain names are among the most costly in the world, and because the letter X is considered lucky in Chinese, you may expect to pay at least a seven-figure price. At number six, his mansion in California. A huge property in the peaceful Californian suburbs of Bel Air is thought to have cost the billionaire $17 million. The estate features seven bedrooms, nine bathrooms, a big screening room, a pool, and a tennis court. The house, divided into four wings, contains a spacious living room and a massive kitchen with a brick ceiling and a large central island. The heated pool outside has a wide terrace and an entertainment area. The house also features a spacious home gym. Musk made headlines in May of 2020 when he announced a plan to sell practically all of his personal belongings, including his home. He followed through on this commitment and sold this Bel Air property for $29 million. The software mogul finished the year on a high note, selling an additional three residences for a total of $62 million, three of which were stashed away in a Bel Air cul-de-sac. At number five, Rocket Man. What's a spaceman without his rocket? Elon Musk's innovative concept of launching humans into space and landing on Mars required him to be able to launch the rocket first. Falcon 9, his first test rocket, is a two-stage orbit lift vehicle designed by SpaceX. Musk designed these rockets with reusable parts so that if a piece falls off, it can be recovered and reused in other rockets. The rocket is valued at more than $62 million. This year, Elon Musk says that SpaceX plans to launch its most used rocket once a week on average. The company's Falcon 9 rocket, which stands 70 meters tall, has gone into orbit roughly 140 times since its inception. Between January 6 and 31st, SpaceX fired four Falcon 9 rockets, putting it on track to launch one rocket into orbit every week on average. The company's fourth launch in 2022 was postponed four times in a row due to severe weather and when a Royal Caribbean cruise liner sailed into the launch zone's hazard area, forcing the operation to be aborted seconds before takeoff. At number four is private jet. After a Twitter feud between Elon Musk and a 19-year-old college student, the Tesla CEO's private jet made the news. While Musk refused to give the adolescent $50,000 to deactivate the Twitter bot that was tracking his private plane, the entire story piqued our interest in the aircraft that transports one of the world's wealthiest people across the globe. The notorious Twitter account is tracking Gulfstream G650ER business plane. The Gulfstream G650ER is the company's flagship model, with a starting price of $66.5 million. It's also the largest Gulfstream business aircraft. The G650ER is a long-range version of the G650 business jet that can go 7,500 nautical miles, about 8,600 miles, without refueling. The jet turns out to be the favorite among wealthy entrepreneurs. Along with Elon Musk, Jeff Bezos uses the business jet, and its sumptuous interior is one of the major factors alongside its unrivaled range. The cabin can seat up to 18 people and can be configured to include up to four living rooms where people can work, dine, entertain, and relax. At number three, Falcon Heavy. Elon Musk felt that after launching the Falcon 9, he needed to create a bigger and more powerful rocket launcher. SpaceX designed and built the Falcon Heavy, a partially reusable heavy lift launch vehicle. It's based on the Falcon 9 vehicle and consists of a stronger Falcon 9 first stage as the central core and two additional first stages as strap-on boosters. When it catapulted Elon Musk's cherry red roadster into orbit around the sun in 2018, the Falcon Heavy captured the world's attention. In April, Musk's space company SpaceX launched a second Falcon Heavy rocket, carrying a 14,000-pound communication satellite for Arabsat, a Saudi Arabian firm. The Falcon Heavy is valued at more than $150 million. It's the vehicle that Elon Musk intends to utilize to transport humans to Mars.
And at number two, Solar City. Elon Musk's Solar City is one of his many businesses. The solar panel company is worth about $3.5 billion and is located in San Mateo, California. Solar panels are sold, manufactured, and installed in both residential and commercial locations all around the world by the company. One reason Elon Musk acquired the company was to create a seamlessly integrated Tesla battery and solar power product that looks beautiful. In 2014, the business stated that a $900 million gigafactory would be built in Buffalo, New York. Tesla's Solar City is spread throughout 20 states, making it a powerful and affluent corporation. Elon Musk's solar company, Solar City, is one of his most valuable assets. And at number one, of course, is SpaceX. Now we've arrived at Elon Musk's most valuable possession. It's one of the companies owned by the business mogul. This private space program, known as SpaceX, is valued at $100 billion. Elon Musk decided to be the first private individual to launch rockets and send people into space. So he birthed SpaceX. And now the world can only watch as the charismatic billionaire writes history with his space factory. And we've come to the end of the video. What particular item in Elon Musk's possession intrigues you? Do you think he's got a fine taste in the choice of transportation? Let me know in the comment section down below. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon, and we'll see you soon.